Today we conclude our study of waiting for God, and we're going to take a look at Hebrews chapter 6, verses 13 through 15, which tell us this. For example, there was God's promise to Abraham. Since there was no one greater to swear by, God took an oath in his own name, saying, I will certainly bless you, and I will multiply your descendants beyond number. Then Abraham waited patiently, and he received what God had promised. Now at first we may think that this is a promise just for Abraham. And yet, if we look carefully at the promises God gave Abraham throughout the Old Testament, we will see that those promises also included all of Abraham's family. Now here's the neat part. The Bible tells us in Romans chapter 8, verse 15, you received God's Spirit when he adopted you as his own children. Now we call him Abba Father. Friends, as believers, we are part of God's family and subsequently also part of Abraham's family. Abraham waited patiently for God and he received what God had promised. God promises to be with us always and will never forsake us. So in your prayers to God, wait patiently for God's answer and he will give you the answer that you need.